everybody what's the fuck up uh, sorry this video uh, how's your mama doing I'm sorry that this video is late I should have did it yesterday uh, last night or yesterday about uh, uh, Anderson Cooper coming out and say he was gay like he said the reason why he came out and said he would he, he came out and did it because he was sick and tired of teens gay teens getting bullied because of their sexuality and them committing suicide because of it to me I think that he did the right thing on that part for real and uh and I'm glad he did it though just to support the kids that are homosexuals who are different and I like to me it's like yes man I hope CNN doesn't fire him if it does just I hope CNN don't fire him because he's a good person he's always been backing up Dr. Phil's work on bullying taking a stand and one thing about it is man I like to do this is kind of funny though I don't like not to you know but uh people know what I mean it's like the, the dude's got a brain he ain't no fucking retarded ass and I'm glad that he did come out. He did come out the closet and tell the, like I hate to use the word coming out the closet and coming out your closet. But uh, I'm glad he did come out and say what he said that he was gay because hey man when you hide like one thing is to be honest not to downplay not to sit there and crack jokes about gay people but. I, it feels to me it's like it's none of my business to know what sexuality you are as long as you're happy of who you are. And I'm glad he's happy of who he is. He finally came out and said, look, I'm gay. If y'all don't like it, y'all can kiss my ass. And, uh, and so, so, it kind of makes you think, man, about where, where this is going to go when he, uh, within, uh, kind of makes you wonder where is this going to go with NB in CNN like it makes you wonder like what's going to happen next but uh like I said I'm glad that he's happy that he came out I'm just to support the kids who are different who are homosexual in, plus in schools because you know that kids that are in school today get harassed and ridiculed because their sexuality because of because of sexuality because of who they are because of what they're all about because they get criticized and I think it's wrong that they get criticized for them being gay and it shows that hey man just because you're gay doesn't mean nothing it doesn't mean you can't be anything you want you can Allison Cooper look at Neil Patrick Harris look at Look at all the big name people who who are gay and, gay and big names. And uh, and one thing. And uh, cause one thing is, man, I, I think people who are gay they actually come out and say do what they do because they come out like he does I actually make it kind of makes me proud in a way because they finally came out instead of hiding it because when you're hiding it it makes it tough and harder on yourself and especially with teenagers in high school it makes them harder or middle kids are in middle school it makes them harder for them because they hide it because they don't want to disappoint their parents but when they see a celebrity like Michael Cooper Somebody like Michael Cooper, he's kind of a celebrity. He's a celebrity to me because he came out and said what he said. When parents see people like Mike, uh, like uh, Anderson Cooper come out and say, "Hey, I'm gay," but if you don't like it, you know what to do. I'm going to do what I got to do, and that's report the news, be on CNN. I'm going to cover these stories. I says I'd rather be a mentor I'd rather be looked up to as a gay man instead of 
looked at as, oh, is he going to rub off on me? Oh, is he going to look at my butt? Is he going to try to fill up me? Is he going to try to hit on me? No, he's going to say, I'm going to support the news and I'm going to support the gay teens and gay middle school kids. And I think, I think he did the right thing. I'm glad he did it, though, just to show the world, hey, he's not a punk. Show the world he's not a punk. He's a better man than half the. He's a better man for coming out and saying it. I know. Uh, what? Uh, it's just. I'm glad. Just glad that he did come out. But I wonder where is this gonna go? I wonder where is this gonna go with him? Is it gonna go to the point where? Go to the point where she and is gonna act a fucking fool, but that's a late, that's another video. But uh, but uh, it's like this though, man. Like I said, man, I'm glad he came out, but to me, hey, he's just a human being, just like everybody else, man. Nobody shouldn't be getting butt out, butt hurt over who's gay, who's straight, because it's none of your fucking business or concern. Whatever they do behind closed doors is their fucking business. That's all it is to it. Yeah. That's all it is, man. That's all it is. Whatever he does behind closed doors should be nobody's business but his. If you're gonna hate him for being gay, then you're the one. Then you are a homo. What is it? Homo homophobe. You're, homo you're homophobic. That's what it is, homophobic. I, I don't have a problem. Stay don't watch your shit. Like, hey, man, I'm gonna support the man no matter what. No matter what, I'm gonna still support the man. I ain't gonna hate. Oh, you're a fucking gay. No, -uh. shit, fuck that. Like I like, like one thing is I like Rosie because she trips me out, and I like Ellen because she trips me out. Like, but. But uh, it's all it's all based on what's gonna happen next for Anderson Cooper. It's all it is. And I'm glad that he did come out. Hey, I salute you, Anderson Cooper. God bless you, son. <laughs> Sorry. Get her done some, man. Shit, if you don't like Anderson Cooper, you could just change the fucking channel. You don't have to support him or kiss his ass to please him. If you don't like Anderson Cooper, just leave, man. I said, because one thing is, if he ain't fucking with you, I don't think you should be fucking with him if you got a fucking problem from him being gay. It's none of your motherfucking concern. He is not hurting you. Because I, I know there's going to be motherfuckers. Oh, since Andrew Coop came out in the car, I was like, he's a fucking fairy. And all that kid. Because you know, there's going to be fucking people that's going to criticize him for being gay. Oh, you were not criticizing him before he came out the closet, but now since he came out the closet, you bitch ass want to criticize him for being gay. Oh, Donald Trump came out the closet and said he was gay. Oh, y'all still be sucking his dick like he was n like nothing else. Nick Rom, what Mitt Romney, Romney, was it? But it's all based. On, but it's like this. I salute this man no matter what. He's a cool dude in my book, man. Like I can say it shouldn't matter if he's gay or straight, man. As long as he does what he knows, what he does best, whatever. He does what he does best. It's report and report the CNN news and keeps it real. And and keep on with the funny YouTube videos, man. He trips me out with the fucking giggle videos. That shit is funny as hell. Cause I keep seeing that shit on on Attack of the Show. Cause that's funny as hell, man. That was just funny as hell to see him. That's it. But like I say, man, I'ma support the man. Just not because not because he's gay. Because he came out to show the world. Hey, man. Just because I can report the news doesn't. Just because I'm gay doesn't mean I can't report the news. He's not letting his homosexuality stand in his wife. Like I'm gay, so what? I'm gonna report the news. Like kiss my ass. Like look how many famous people that actually came from that. They actually made some of them themselves for being gay. Elton John, gay but still makes music. RuPaul does TV shows. Still make good money. Ellen DeGeneres got her own talk show. Still makes good money. Anderson Cooper 
has one hell of a show. Still makes good money. And that's all there is to it. That's all there is to it. But ladies and gentlemen, I'm going to say this, man. If you don't like Anderson Cooper, kiss my ass. Well, ladies and gentlemen, you can follow me on Twitter at Afro Joe, Afro Joe the Wookie. Subscribe to my channel, CeeLo Jr. 2 and CeeLo Jr. 3. Tell me what you think. If you don't like what I got to say, you can kiss my ass and burn in here because you really don't matter to me what you say. But if you down with you, if you agree, like, cause one thing is, I hate racist people. I hate homophobia. Uh, homo, what's it? The people that hate gay people. That say, uh, uh, the people that scared of hope, homosexuals, homophobes. I hate them because one thing is, gay people is like any everybody else. You just can't tell if they're gay or straight. They can want, they can act straight, but you don't know if they're gay or straight. Nobody that never knew that he was gay until he says something but I'm glad that he did come out ladies and gentlemen gay people I say homosexuals are people too that's all it is and like I said follow me on Twitter Afro Joe the Wookie subscribe to my channel CeeLo Jr. 2 CeeLo Jr. 3 and if you hate gay people I hope you burn in hell for all I care because gay people are pe homosexuals are, are people too gay people are not the enemy that's what I'm tired of people judging people because their race or their sexuality or their gender this man is is busting his ass trying to bring you something so that's how it is this Afro Joe peace by the hair grease everybody look look show everybody some love now it's 2012. Show some love. Get the fuck over it. Who's gate? Who's straight? Bullshit. I don't give a fuck. Long as you cool with me, and that's all it is in my book. Peace and a body hair grease. Peace.